The following is a presentation of the Eagles Sports Network. Hi, everybody. I'm Mark Mausner of the Eagles Sports Network, and alongside me is Carson Newman, cross-country acting coach Luke Greer, head of the National Championships in Sacramento, California. And, and Luke, you uh, first year as a coach, you got uh, Rachel Strayer going to national uh, nationals. It was a goal of yours and, and obviously hers for the entire year. Um, and speaking of that entire year, from a kind of 50,000-foot perspective, looking back at some of the struggles she had to deal with, missing Wingate due to injury earlier in the year, how big is it for her? What, you know, what does it really say about her mental and physical strength to have been able to fall through those things and get to uh, the top of the mountain here in Nationals? Well, I mean, I remember last December, Rachel, Rachel Fitt finding out that it was in Sacramento, California. She's saying, I'm going to be there. Um, so now it's a really cool point that we've we, we've come through the the spring, we've come through the fall, and and she is going there. Um, and like last year, she had a great year, freshman of the year for the sack and the, and those kind of things. And she had injuries then. Um, so our goal this year was to stay pretty much injury injury free, and we did it predominantly. She missed the Wingate one, but other than that, she stayed injury free, and it just shows how talented she is that she managed to get to nationals now. Um, so yeah, I mean it's a great experience for her. It's, it, she she did a great job this season. Um, just really proud of her and looking forward to seeing how she does in California. And she'll be side by side with really the nation's best runners at the Division Two level. Uh, a uh, a race that you ran twice, you know the nationals. And what do you think she can? Uh, how can she grow as a runner, but also as a person in such a, such a momentous event in her college career and in most people's lives? I think it'd be a pretty big event. It's, it's a huge event, and, and, and when you get there, you're kind of taken aback by, by all the people, especially at the race. The start line is just packed with loads and loads of people, and you know you are racing against the best people in the country. Um, I think it would be a great experience for her. This As a sophomore, going to sophomore will be great for her, and then hopefully the next couple of years to come, she'll be going each year, and she can just learn each time from those experiences and just take it all in. Um, it, it, you have to be mentally tough in these times. There's going to be a lot of people going off way too hard. Um, she's going to have to be smart in the race and she is she's a smart runner um, so I'm not worried about that I'm just just want her to do her best and enjoy it most of all because this is her first one hopefully not her last one I don't think it will be her last one um, but enjoy this first one enjoy the experience and just and just get the feel for it and what can you tell us about the course and the strategy that you think she should take kind of based on the course and then based on the uh, improved level of competition overall so I, I don't know too much about the course. I know it's on a golf course. I know it's a couple laps around a golf course. Mm -hmm. um, not sure how hilly it is, but I'm, I look to the weather. I'm pretty sure it's going to be nice weather around 70 degrees, um, which should be perfect running weather. Um, and I mean, like I said, I, I can see a lot of people going off too hard. They get excited at nationals. And I mean, ev everybody does it. You get that adrenaline rush and you, and you go off way too hard. Um, so hopefully I can kind of temper those temper those uh, that adrenaline and, and hold Rachel back a little bit and her strength is picking people off through the race we've done it the whole season and and I'm hoping that now she can use those experiences and bring it into nationals they'll be they'll, she'll be running with people the whole time that's the great thing about these events where there's loads of people you'll always be running with people um so yeah I mean she she can use those experiences she can pick them off and I'm just looking forward to having a great race he's cross-country acting coach Luke Greer coach thanks for the time thank you